What's happening when you see a picture like this? Dark or rust colored markings on material surfaces that have been rubbing against one another could be in another indication of fretting corrosion. Many metals appear to have even surfaces, but look at them under a microscope and you'll see grooves and pits invisible to the naked eye. Contact between these uneven surfaces scrapes away top surface layers, leaving subsequent layers subject to oxidation, which can then, in turn, lead to chemical corrosion and failure. In our industry, we typically recognize fretting before discoloration of the metal hose surface when small grooves appear where the braid erupts against the hose. Since the tensile strength of the braid is greater than the tensile strength of the hose, the braid wires saw into the hose, creating these abrasions. Applications experiencing vibration under a load or pressure fluctuations in tight fitting parts are good candidates for fretting corrosion as are high dynamic cycling applications. There are a few ways you can design these kinds of assemblies to reduce fretting. For instance, we might suggest lubrication. Weather may be on your side as well. Where humidity is high, wear between the surfaces becomes less severe as moisture acts as a layer of protective lubricating film. Ultimately though, it's regular maintenance and routine material inspections that will defend against all types of corrosions and increase the lifespan of a hose and service. Our Director of Quality and Engineering, Janet Allison, has a great video on what to look for when inspecting your hose assemblies. That video identifies the nine most common causes of hose failure and is available in our video library on penflex.com or on our YouTube channel. Go check it out.